what is up ladies and gentlemen backs here and we're going through some fun stuff because we have a lot of demos out there that are now accessible for this weekend only for the next few days so given the state of current affairs get out there and demo some of these excellent games on steam steam spring independent festival something like that there's a bunch on there check them out the first one we're gonna be checking out is filament this has been on our wish list for a few months now and i can't wait to get into the demo and see just how much fun we're gonna have uh so why wait we're going to uh go ahead and click play game warning approaching vessel oh there's an approaching signature vessel. indicates it's a filament corporation vessel okay no crew detected. Caution advised. Minimum distance of 200 nautical miles recommended. Rerouting trajectory. Approaching vessel. Docking request pending. Override acknowledged. Please click all the images containing an asteroid. Docking procedure initialized. Why, thank you. <laughs> oh, we cruising. Docking in progress. Is that a beer? Is that we had the neon? Weird. That's home. That looked like home right there. Looked great. All right. So WASD. You guys know the drill there. Um, the mouse shifts. You can see the mouse is moving a little bit. So mouse controls a little bit. Are we wearing a mask? Looks like we're wearing some kind of a mask. All right, so let's uh, play some cards. Excellent. Wow, really love, really love the way this environment looks. Ooh, this is clean. Okay, so we can see down there in the uh, E to interact. Okay. What? So we are accessing this bot from the other side. Tab is returned to the ship. Space bar to rewind. Oh, oh, so that takes us back. Got it. So we're on like a tether. Okay. So we are taking the energy that opens the door so doing this touching this to this and now if we push uh tab nope kidding so we actually have to run through so i think we run back through the door ah there we go okay interesting so that's actually like a puzzle so we actually like go into the interface to actually open the door. Next one. Now down on the bottom, we also have So down on the bottom here, oh, and we can't run back through it. So we'll need to remember that for later. Doom doom doom. Hold F to focus. Oh, okay. Interesting. So, ooh, this is cool, actually. So you see what, what the reason, so then I can hold spacebar to go backwards. Oh, that's cool. So we do this because physics needs to apply the pressure, right? Because if we did this, right, we're not gonna actually get there. So this means when we go around this, we're applying the pressure, and then we're coming back to the inside. Um, I actually might, no, I think that'll work. Sick. Uh, hello? Hello. What's up? There. Yep, I'm here. Um, well, let's interact. Would you look at that. An intruder. Guilty. You're a little more disheveled than your traditional knight in shining armor. I was hoping to be saved by someone without mustard stains on their dungarees for one. Oh, get out of here. But as you might be my only ticket off this I don't have mustard stains. I'll make do. I've been trapped in this cockpit for a few weeks now, and this is the first time anything on this damn console has perked up. 
Whatever you did to those anchors on your way in, it it's seemed following us. You see that? Taking a look at that one over by the wall. Please, it's following us. We're gonna get some sci-fi. Okay, so I want to see what's on the Grim Leaper. Ten out of ten. Trying to be on the stars to harvest your soul. Oh, <laughs> that's great. This week only, free with any select purchase. Collectors. Do, 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 do. Okay, we can of course manipulate. Win beans. Mail or phone. Do you like beans? Of course you like beans. We have, if anything, too many beans. That's why we're passing our delicious, nutritious, and concerningly ambiguous seed-based stocks onto you. Why? Because again, I can't stress this enough. We have too many beans. If you would like a chance to win more beans than you and your entire extended family could possibly eat in a thousand lifetimes, here's what you have to do. Mail us at the beans are a burden. <laughs> That's my new band name. The beans are a burden. Beans are a burden. We suggest that after entering our raffle, you begin preparing adequate storage for too many beans. What else do we got? This is great. Laser monocle. Impress your friends, blind your enemies, gain class. In order to get your hands on your very own laser monocle, please send this cut out along with 999G to the address provided. As a Class C energy weapon, do not point or fire the laser monocle at another person. Doing so may result in serious injury or death. Ensure that the laser monocle is pointed away from your eye before use. Uh, Loki takes no responsibility or any for any chain cause due to okay it's getting a little too small for my eyes on that one learn to collage by watching a horse what is a horse we don't know either but we're we've heard of them and we're pretty sure they have secrets secrets like collage and next week's lottery numbers we don't trust them we don't trust them at all we would watch one though and so should you just think of all the things you might learn just think and then this down here is actually a cryptogram of sorts um could be it looks like maybe pig pen maybe a pig pen in these uh in these hexagon cubes uh so we might actually come back to this to try to solve this with uh utilizing pig pen but i don't think it is um we'll keep going maybe there's actually something in the game that will allude to that because the format isn't pig pen but it does look like these may allude to something like that or something else who knows okay pushing escape oh nope. actually i want to know so uh oh there's an x up in the top all right so reading was fun and let's go onward um not there they want us to take a look at something on the wall there we go this thing now it's showing me five so is this saying there are five steps to actually move forward from this let's see Right, because we got the five. We got the five there. Hold R to restart. All right, so we need to be touching these outsides. This, so the reason I'm doing this is I'm assuming, so we're utilizing what they've given us, but also if we don't do that, we're actually going to block our, remember, we can't walk through. So that's to make sure that we can actually get back through here. We're going to be able to put pressure on this. Now, does that pressure both? It does. Now the issue is here, this won't apply pressure. So we actually have to go over to the other side. I love this. This is super awesome. So we'll go through. That was one, puzzle two now. Um, now, now, oh, that's last. You see, if we do this, we're once again covering up our exit. So we're gonna put our pressure here. This applies pressure here. Now to make sure we get through all of this. Oh, interesting. So I think we actually go down here. Oh, cool. So we have to go, we have to wrap around on this one. This is interesting. So we could do, that won't get that one. Let's just take a second here. So to wrap on this, we can go up to the right. Oh, yeah, 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 maybe this. So we do this, and then this. There we go, okay. Now we just pop up here, come back through. Stage two done, let's go to stage three. Hold tab to return to the ship. I'm good. 
Ship is for suckers. We want the puzz. All right, so there's our two. Let's take a look. Oh, okay, hold on. We actually want to go over here first, I think. Like that. Then we come back. This is going to activate over here so we can pull this down. Okay. Now, how are we going to get this to work, though? I think we have to do more loops. So hold on. So this is good. And then we're going to run all the way back, I think. So we're just trying to apply that pressure. Man, this is a really long... It's a long whatever it is. But this is super cool. I'm really enjoying this. This is a very cool, like, physics-based physics, physics -based puzzling bit. Ooh. That looks different. Okay. So how are we going to get this one? That is interesting. So we have to apply pressure, right? It's got to have pressure on it. How can we hold that pressure right there? I got to think that... Oh, I see. So, okay. So I'm looking at the ground and I'm seeing this. Let's just see. Yep. That opens up that wall over there. You see that? So we're here. That's going to open up this wall. This is going to open up that wall. And then I'm going to be completely stuck. Kidding. Remember, the walls are open. All right. Cool. New puzzle, new puzzle ideas, new things to explore, to understand. So that's going to open up that wall. That's going to open up that wall. So two wall. Actually, does it open that wall? Yes, it does. Excellent. Okay. So you can go down here. I'm just kind of winging this. We're winging this momentarily. Momentary. Momentary winging. Hmm. I don't know if that stays. Yeah, that doesn't. So we're going to leave that one, actually. We're going to come back to it. Oh, let's go this way so we don't cut off our path. Good. Um, ooh, so close. Yeah, it's so far. So then I can do this. And this might get a little crazy here, team. We might get a little crazy here. Ooh, three times through the same door? What? Yeah, we're absolutely nuts. Let's what go. What do you know? You're a natural. And you're great. Looks to me like you shut it down entirely, which makes a lot of sense now that I think about it. Yeah. I never imagined how much the anchors would mess with the ship's systems when the others installed them. I agree. I guess they really fried some circuits down there, huh? Indeed. On the bright side, I do now appear to have full access to the annex you're standing in. Now, Congratulations. I it's a Glad big I could help. ask, considering we just met and insulted you but True. if you keep shutting down the anchors like that i might have a real chance at getting out of here alive what do you say what choice do i have if you put oh, puzzles in front of me let me grab those doors for you i'm going to solve them i'm really really interested in this uh this cryptogram down here very very interested in solving that so we will be coming back to that we will get we may get out a pen and paper and see what we can do. Okay. Ooh. Cool. So there's I love the environment. The environment is it's clean, it's interesting. Soundtrack gets, you know, currently we're gonna go ahead and toss a ten out of ten. Um let's see where this attaches to before we just hop in and go nutty. Just you know, curiosity. Oh, we can actually walk all the way over here. That's interesting. Hmm. This is very, this is, this is interesting. Cause I feel like there's a lot of stuff going on exterior to the main idea and story. So we actually go through that door. We're gonna go back. We're gonna go back and we're gonna do this stuff. Let's solve. Four, four levels. Just hell yeah let's go what do we got orange what are the colors for it looks like they're changing color too and also these turned orange you can see this is orange now so it changes the color once we go over that color so this goes to orange Do they have to be in pairs? Oh, so it is. It's paired off. 
paired off, you saw that it does turn black. And look, this protects it. This protects once we have that there. So since there's already a strand on there, we don't have to worry about that. Ooh, it's clean. It's clean and exciting. So this is going to be two. Oh, it's, it needs to be orange. Oh, that's slick. Real slick. This is awesome. I'm actually... This is not fake excitement at all. I just want... I want you to know this is genuine excitement. This is really... This is really cool. And then we'll actually do a full wrap here so we can go all the way back around. I don't think I've solved puzzles... I don't think we've played a puzzle game that has these mechanics. Um, or at least this... Not something like this. Oh, we have to get those blues, don't we? So we're actually going to blue first. Ooh, but how? Yikes. Interesting. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. That's blue. So we have to go like... Oh, but that doesn't give us the blue. Okay. I should probably check my work first. So let's see. Yep, so we are going to have to get those. That's going to darken. What if we go orange first? No, because we can't get over to the other side for orange. And once we take this, if as soon as we touch anything else, like that's not going to be it's not going to be it. So blue first and on blue. Now, I can't hit that because that turns off the blue. That's going to now, can we do anything with the dark? I imagine that'll become a part of the uh, puzzle solving process eventually. Hmm, this is excellent. It's cool that they also enabled this. This is this is a very good idea. Give the top down so you can like work the paths in your head. You can't move. You can't move all this is while you're in focus mode. So trying to do that right now just to make sure that's clear. And if we go, so I kind of want to do this, but then once again, like, you know, we're locked out. We can't activate those. Okay. So it leaves us very few options. So once it's once it's shut off like that. Wait, 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 wait. Can we go back through on this? Oh snap. <gasps> Can we do this? Because when we go through this so the blue still activates the orange the orange doesn't activate on it because it's 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 empty it's not one of the ones that's gonna that only activates from blue so as soon as it's activated but the orange is already there whoa <laughs> my name's juniper by the way oh wow. i get the feeling you aren't gonna tell me yours so i may just have to give you one we are Filament Chip. Court protocol is to allocate every loyal operative a color-based code name. Oh, Fortunately, cool. no one told you that you should just pick one color and stick with it. Honestly, what I'm seeing is a little bit of a mess, so I might need to take a different approach to naming you. Oh. Red and blue are heroic, and you are my hero. Oh. But those are taken, and with all due respect, you've got nothing on Vermilion and yours truly. Okay. When I was a kid, I used to love this book. I would Ooh. read it over and over again. The main character was Pluto, a socially inept bear with a can-do attitude. He tried his best. So, that's what I'm gonna call you. Pluto. Yeah, I like it. I kinda like it too, actually. What's this? Oh my. Add item to inventory. Visit computer trying to view your inventory. Oh my god, that's so cool. This is showing us a path. Okay. Whoops, I keep pushing the escape on those. Okay. And then there's another path. I don't know where we're going to use these paths yet. 
And I really am curious about why we can walk up here. I, I think I, it could just, I mean, clearly these platforms are here, right? New? Okay, hold on. We're looking up what that means. Because I, I like vaguely remembered that that's some, some thing. I just can't remember. Since 1983, developing the free Unix style operating system so the computer users can have the freedom to share and improve the software they use. 1983, and they're suggesting this game was made in 1983. If we remember the front, uh, the front page, the main page, it said in the corner, 1983. Interesting. Okay. So it could be that. Uh, also, it's an animal. Kind of looked like a bison ish thing. All right. More puzz. Oh, we got, oh, we got pathing now. So, now this, this presents us, how are we going to get that blue? We almost did it. Almost did it first try. So, the blue is going to be tough, but I think we do this, and then this opens it all up. Nailed it. All right, one down, two to go. So three, four colors now. You're gonna toss four colors at me. Uh-oh. And we have a little hoopty dink So I would think we would wanna go outside. We'd wanna go outside first. Now I'm trying to do this uh, with, uh, like, intuition-ish. How would I get the second? Okay, so hold on. Once we go here, how am I planning to get the blue one above me? This one, to get a hook on this one, as soon as I do this, I don't think I have a way to apply pressure to it. So that leads me to believe we want to go for blue first because at least I know I can hook this one. So if we do this, this keeps the path open. But now I'm right into the same issue. How do I get back over to the orange? Now this, work with me on this one. But then how, yeah. Ooh, this is tough. This is good. Ooh, oh my God, this is like, I'm like low key freaking out at how cool these puzzles are. Like, we've played, we've played a lot of puzzle games, both, uh, you know, streaming on our stream and doing these videos, and my god, this is, I don't think we've experienced something quite like this. I'm trying to remember a time we did. So what if we leave those like this? So now we're gonna, so we're basically saying, okay, we gotta think, we clearly have to think outside of the box in some capacity. Now... This lets us do this, but then we'll hit we'll hit blue. So is there a way for me to do like this? No. But I like I like our idea here. So outside 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 in, does this leave us a way to get out? No. <laughs> the answer is no. So what if, what if we try to leave ourselves a way out by doing this? But then we're gonna hit that blue no matter what. Wait, we could do this though. So what if we don't even hit that, that pink one early? What if we just try to set up like this? Hit blue, ooh, that's why. So what if we use this? Okay. Are we, can we double layer? But then once I do this, I gotta actually loop all the way back. Which I think we can do. Do 
Do I leave myself a way out? I don't. Is there any way for me to keep the loop on the outside so that I can actually get back over to the pink ones? So there is a way for me to do this. Now this is what we did before, right? Now what if we don't, what if we don't bother with the blue, the teal, sorry, we'll call it teal just yet. What if we do this? Nope, because that'll cut us off. And if we do this, we're really going to cut this one off. And then we won't be able to get the orange. So we can go orange, orange, blue, and then we're just absolutely fucked. Okay, let's let's pull it back. Okay, we're going to pull it back. We're going to take some, some zen, some zen breaths. <laughs> Done. And we're going to try to... It really feels like we can do this, right? But this really screws us up. I wonder if we need to utilize something like this early. Okay. But then we can't get out. Okay. But wait. Okay. Good, 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 good. So what if we do this? And we go out here. Oh, because that screws us up. We can't do that. But I like... Okay. Right idea. Right idea. So here to here. Let's loop it. Let's not loop it. The whole reason is because I need to be able to get, so I think I have to do something like this. That's gonna be, yeah. And then we came around to the outside, like this. I feel like I'm on the precipice of getting it. Like we're, so, I'm so close. Okay, let's try some unorthodox stuff just to that me no that that's a that's a that's a horrible idea i don't mind this idea all that much i think this is i think this is an interesting way to come over and to grab all this shenane now now i think I think I have accurately shown that from here, like, this is an unsolvable state. You can see the little wheel underneath if you're holding down the reset. But then how do I get... That's, that's the issue. This actually is a solve. This is a solve if if I can get through here. So that's why I was trying to look at how we could take this, go around magenta top right. So maybe let's think about it. What do you guys think about that? Thinking about it. That's a, that's a pretty, that's a pretty interesting idea. Then I'd have to loop around that all the way back. But it does keep us open center to potentially come back. This is just me trying something out of curiosity. Do I have to create like a barrier? Can I fit through there? Nope. That's close. That's close. God. Team. 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 
Oh my god, yes! <laughs> Look at that shit. Wow! <laughs> that feels really good. Woo! What a puzzle. Alright, we've got... We're running tricolor. Orange has to grab early there and then loop around. Okay, so. Let's keep outside open. Now that actually won't grab unless we do this. So we actually have to do like a wrap around this one. That may be why I can't do this because boom, pressed. And then if I do this, like, okay, that's really cool and all, but now there's no way for me to get that blue right there. I'm glad that stays like that. So teal is done. I have no way to put pressure on orange. Okay, so I'm starting to actually like understand the way we have to look at this. We have to look at it in ways of like pressure points, right? So the blue one that's right next to us right now, that one needs pressure from the left. Orange on the bottom needs pressure from the top. Like if we can start to analyze in the cardinal directions here, the way that we need to apply pressure. So, for example, to get out of this one, we need, this is pressure that must be applied. Like we don't have a choice on that, right? Now this will apply now what I'm what I'm worried about is the orange one right here. So we have to keep that one available to do this. And I think we did it. So this is this is the idea here. Well, I thought we did it. Maybe we didn't though. Oh no, we can do this. There we go. Oh no, it's so close. Is there something for me to loop this around? I'm just running over here. I just want to loop around something, man. Shoot. Well, damn. Nope. Oh, oh, careful. No. Oh. I can't do this. So maybe there is actually a way for me to... So there's got to be something that we do that's just slightly different than what we're doing. So let's just back it up. This has to remain free. So we're actually going to go over here and I think we're going to do teal first. Last time we tried to do this, of course, this doesn't give us the top pressure. That's right. So what if we actually go here? Let's go around. Nope, because as soon as we do that, we cut off our access to purple. So this is so what I was trying to do in my head is I was trying to say, okay, well, how can we get access to these things some other way? So here we go like this. Now we have not only have we done the same, like we've, we've gotten to the same state that we were in before, but now we actually have the pressure point. So I think, oh, okay. So let's go over here. Can we still walk through there? That's a bummer. This feels like the solve, so let's just take a second here. Maybe like that? Going up top would close this off. So I don't necessarily want to do that. So there might just be a different way for this right here. Like this. Oh, nope, that seals it. So maybe this is actually okay. Maybe this is good. But what are we missing here? Oh, I push shift and hey, guess what? It does exactly what I 
what I thought shift would do. Man, that's a bummer that that actually doesn't touch there. Okay. So I like this play. I like this play right here. Getting these purples out, but maybe we can actually save purple. What if we try to do, like, see, as soon as we do this, though, we can't get the purple, so we can't do that. We can't do that. Purple, anything off of the purple has to be done right away. So let's take a different avenue. What if, what if we go... I have to use this. It'd be ridiculous for me to just, like, skip right past it like this, right? Maybe? That seals it off. Like, this is making it so I can't do anything. My thought here being that I would go like this and... Yeah. So, okay. This is awesome. This is so cool. Okay. So let's look. We could go outside bottom, but then that locks off orange and teal. I think I, I think we 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 have the idea of the solvents that center orange that we aren't able to actually apply proper pressure with our top top left uncolored pillar. So perhaps the bottom orange one is something we can grab on the way out. Because remember, out is going back towards. So there's there's something a little unorthodox in the way that we have to solve this. And I think teal might be something we can grab on the way out, potentially. Over, around. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do... We're going to do... We're going to do perp. We're going to do perp, and we're going to save that outside. There's perp. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go like this. I think this is the right idea. I think this is the right idea. We could actually even do this instead. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go, team! Oh, come on. Don't do me like this. For the love of God, don't do me like this. How the hell do I get pressure on this wall? There we go. Oh my gosh. Oh! Don't! Oh! Okay, okay. But now at least we got it. At least we got one... We got a piece of this thing to actually make sense. We are going to count that as a... as a win. So this is actually like this. There we go. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> ah, no. <laughs> Wait. Where's the last pixel? Can't back solve this one, team. Can't do it. Okay. So we're just going to do teal last. It's so nice to have someone listening oh. again after talking to myself for a few weeks. <laughs> it feels so validating, you know? Like, all I needed was an audience to feel a little more grounded. Yeah, it's true. Having it's the real. others around, we felt like a family. It's been so long since I had something like that. Now they're gone. Kind of feels like a dream now, or a blur. Maybe none of it was real. Maybe, yeah. You're real though, right? No, well, no. Nope. It's My name's fine nope. if you're not. Pluto. I just think we should be honest with each other. Right. True. What's this? Oh, another map for how we do something. And this one has a red. This one has a red mark right there. Apartment, well-being, vermilion. Hmm, 
interesting. Okay. Oh, there's some plants. We still got that thing following us around. What's this? Uh, Wayfarer's cards. Archives down there. Recovery mode activated. Awaiting archive entry. Oh. Oh, that's clean. Oh, wow. Well, this is interesting. Uh, system reports, systems. So floor one, floor two, okay. Anchor collectible. And then whatever that is, I love this. There are layers to this. 78DC4150, I look forward to seeing what that means as well. We have dice down there in the bottom left, it looks like. 41. Let's see what's in re removable storage. Jupiter, Vermilion, Pistachio, Canary, Aubrey. Oh my god, this is great. Holy mother. Um, messages, logs. Okay, so we have a lot to explore here. <laughs> we have a lot to explore. Love the environment of this. This is... Uh, let's go to some more puzzles. We got five. Five layers on this one. Oh. There we go. So that, that. Oh. Oh. Okay. Great. Good, 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 good. So new, new mechanic. Upon activation. Upon activation of either of them. Whew. The wall comes up. Man. Okay, this one doesn't activate any of it. So I'm thinking, how many walls can I actually prevent here? Um, what if we do this? It means a lot of walls come up. Maybe that's okay, though. Yeah, doesn't matter. Because we don't need those walls anyway. Oh my. Okay. And then this should grab all of them, right? Yeah. Okay. Whew. After those color ones, it's nice to have a, a little bit of breathing room. So they will activate whatever is next to them. Oh, that's no good. I can't go that way. Okay, hold on. So can we go? Ooh, nope. Can't do that. Maybe. Maybe we can do that? Nope. That locks that up. I already knew that was going to happen, too. So, hold on. I need to go through like this. But that's not going to grab that one. That's the problem. So, is there a way for me to do this? There is. We don't care about that wall. It's more important... This. That's gonna lock it out. This is the same thing, but backwards. I'm doing, doing the exact same thing I just did. Go backwards. Is there a way? Damn it. I thought 
I was clever. Where's my jump button? <laughs> Where's the jump button? We need a jump button here. Okay. So. That's actually not the worst start, actually. Interesting. So is there a way for us to get out and around? So if we did like this... You see what I mean? Like, if we could do this and then loop here, we could run all the way back and loop here and then be done. So... Can I really not... There, I really want to, like, kind of break it. <laughs> like, back solve it, as some people would call my, my solving technique. See, and then that... See, that can't happen. And I can't loop back through. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to find a way to keep all these things open. So what if we go both of these? That's a lock and that's a lock. So that's no good. Now we've done this before. As soon as I touch that, like we're, we're locked out. This presents a double lock that we can't get through. This is a, is a lock. I think I did that too already. That's the exact same thing. So I think what we may have to do is we may have to go. We may have to try to save. Somehow we actually have to get, we have to do this, right? That's not going to change what happens there, though. puzzle here. Very symmetrical. That's a bad idea. Mm, but then now do I get that one? Okay. Same thing applies there, too. So maybe like a double wrap like this, but then I can't get through. So maybe we go like this. We go outside. And then somehow, though, we leave ourselves the inside track. That's going to cause a problem, though. Unless we go like this. And then I can't get this one, though. So hold on. Okay. Well, that's no good. We can't take one of these outsides first, so it is a cross here. We know that, because as soon as we do this, the puzzle's not solvable. Either side, symmetrical. So then what if we go inside? This gives us a light with... But then if we take this, no bueno. And we obviously can't go around this way, because no bueno. Then where do we go? Boop. Nothing. Is 
So what we need to do, we can't go up through there either. This is awesome. Okay, but we can, we can tuck that. Tuck this. I think we did it. Then we go like this. Then we go up here. Oh! Yes! <laughs> Woo! Almost got I stuck there. walking around this ship is a lot like going through a stranger's house. Yep. So allow me to put you at ease by introducing our little breakfast club to you. Oh. The headmaster, if you will, was Canary. Okay. She headed up research here. Good. Then there was Marmalade and Aubergine. You'll have to blame Philcor for the names here. Those two were responsible no for all the systems you see here on the ship. Nothing Real blame. smart dudes. Then there was Vermilion. He was our well-being officer. He controlled our diets and kept us exercising. Kindest man I've ever met. And from Earth of all places. Finally, there was our botanist. Pistachio. Uh. Oh, and there's me, of course. The navigator. Oh, that's the end? But we have so we do. Oh. I want more! Continue exploring. Thank you. Whew. Okay. Because there's still some things I want to investigate. Hey, this is where I took my first few steps aboard the Alabaster. My first time aboard a Philcor ship, actually. I boarded with Pistachio. We exchanged some small talk while we lugged our stuff up on the gangway together. We're both from the firmament, though we didn't know each other from before the mission. It was only after we arrived here and had a proper chance to talk that we realized we'd actually grown up not far from one another. Different schools, though. Okay, so the only thing left, I do want to take a note here. First thing I want to note is down here you can see that there's, there's an answer to something. Like, you can see the puzzle, and I wonder if they're actually identical puzzles and you see that we have the top and the bottom. I'm actually gonna, I wanna go do this right now. So we have up, so we have up loop. This is set four by four. You know what this reminds me a lot of? Do you guys know the answer before I even say it? Is the answer the witness? Because the answer is the witness for me. You have a puzzle format with multiple solutions and that's what we're rolling with. So this looks like it goes up and down loops under and goes up and cuts off. Then we are returning down here like this. Down, up, and around. Okay, so now we're gonna go over here, and I think we're gonna have our top half right here. So we see that this goes up like this, and then the answer actually goes all the way up and loops underneath the bottom one. Let's go put this into the machine, and let's see, let's see what Mouse wheel up is to select. Okay, so hold on. So. We're gonna go up, down. We go up like this. We're gonna come down under, like so. And that is, that's it. That's the, that's, that's. Nope, I didn't do it right. This needs to loop underneath here. I'm mean, asking for all turns without re-entering its archive. Sick! What do we do? Um, messages? m m -budgeses? So that doesn't do anything. This, the Film and Corporation are proud to announce the unveiling of the new uh, Cerulean Sector. As you're all aware, the firmament is always evolving and expanding. Today, after years of hard work by thousands of people, the firmament finally has its very own stretch of idyllic coastline. Image not found. The sector is a five kilometer stretch of artificial coastline complete with sun, sea, and sand. State-of-the-art wave machines simulate the serene lapping of waves on the shore whilst carefully designed fans and speakers help to replicate an authentic atmosphere. Image not found. Visitors will be blown away by the attention to detail. Would be forgiven for thinking they were really spending a day out on Earth. The sand and rocks were imported, especially along with a colorful 
selection of ende endemic flora and fauna. Whether you're interested in a fun day out of the whole family, out for a luxury res residential location or prime business spot, the Cerulean sector will be fully open to the public on the 15th of August. In the meantime, apply for a residential premises. Apply for a business premises. Cool. Cool, cool. And we can't get to the messages. But this is... Okay. Cool. So that was cool. Uh, let's go enter that other one, too. Now, unfortunately, my memory... I could try to do this from memory. Should we try to do this one from memory? Let's try to do this one from memory. All the way outside, loop top left two. All the way outside, top left two. All the way outside, top left two. All the way outside, top left two. Let's see. Let's see what that what that activates. All the way outside, top left two. Still can't get to the messages thing. Know your augmentation provider. So you're thinking of getting a new augment. Maybe it's your first. Congratulations, this is great. Augmentations vastly improve the lifestyle of their user. I know I couldn't go back. Whilst choosing your augmentation provider. It is an exciting and rewarding experience. It is also incredibly important to vet a provider to check they have your best interest at heart. Fortunately, the Augment Regulatory Board has put together a short list of things to watch out for. Only augment what is already there. It is against the law to add any additional limbs. Only augment the limbs you have. If anyone offers that an extra arm, get out of there. Augments must not be fully concealed. For safety, any augments must be apparent to others. There are various ways this can be done to be as subtle as possible. If anyone offers to give you an augment that is entirely invisible, get out of there. Internal organs can only be augmented with the express permission from TFC and by a TFC endorsed provider that they will refer you to. If anyone offers to replace a heart. If a provider passes all of these guidelines, then go ahead and enjoy a better life. Excellent. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Excellent. So we've solved a couple bagels. That's cool. Now let let's take let's take a quick little gander here. This is cool from the perspective that it seems the environment has elusive offerings. Oh, that's why. Look at all this stuff. This is basically the interstellar equivalent of living out of your suitcase. Say, did you know that Philcor sent us away with Equinox brand tea? I didn't even know that people actively chose to buy that stuff, let alone buy the crate. Look, I don't want to sound like a snob and say that brand names are always better, but when it comes to tea, they obviously are, right? I mean, yeah, loose leaf. Do we see anything else? I mean, it, it, there's the suggestion that everything could be something else. More importantly, though, there's this. So that's going to be a mystery that we're probably going to have to come back to at some time. I think we're going to call this the demo. Succeeded, locked away, and not 100%ed. I can't honestly say 100% because there could be something else going on that I'm not entirely aware of. But we also didn't, I'm, I can't go for this solve because um, it will require a little more setup. I want to get my digital pen and tablet out. We want to go get the internet up and just start, you know, searching for how we're going to apply this. It could also be something that isn't as complicated as I'm making it, but I think it probably is, which really excites me. That all being said, uh, that's it. What a demo. What an excellent. Go check this out right now, okay? If you're watching this video, you can play this yourself. Uh, even though you just saw all the answers, it doesn't matter. Figuring it out is still going to be difficult because we ran into some issues. I imagine you'll run into some issues too, as long as you're watching the video and solving at the same time. Anyway, please have a wonderful day. Stay safe out there. Wash your damn hands. And uh, check out Filament. Wishlist it. Follow on the, uh, on the Steam page so you can see when it's going to go live. Because the full game of this is going to be amazing if this demo demo when straights that's awful um probably probably need to end it there before i dig myself a bigger hole thank you so much for watching have a wonderful day